Yeah, safety paramount as always, and we we've partnered with the best in the business, and that's the NSRI. And uh, Ian Gray and his team uh, are 100% committed uh, behind our event. It serves as a really good operation for them to test uh, both um, sea and land-based um, resources. And the planning around it and working with them to ensure we've got safety for our paddlers is incredible. This is a race not for big numbers, it's a core event and only core paddlers are entering. And uh, it's, it's, it's really important that each paddler can look after himself out there, but we do have the NSRI, which is great. You know, there's one thing that hasn't been spoken about, and that is the real wild card, and that is the surf. And uh, it's quite daunting if you're paddling along, and as we did one year, when we were five k's from Woody Cape, the waves were as high as a double-story building. And, uh, you know, people were airlifted, they were helicopter lifted out of the surf zone because it was so, oh, it was radical. When you're on a surf ski craft, which most people wouldn't be able to just balance in, to keep yourself stable, to keep a level head, to deal with surf at various points of coming in, because there are checkpoints halfway to ensure all, all competitors are accounted for. But those, those points normally throw up some lovely challenges or opportunities as we call it. So um, when you throw all that into the mix and you're taking day on day, it, it really takes a great resolve. And once you've done this surf ski race, you really know you, you've challenged yourself and that's why it's called the challenge.